Canfield putting their unbeaten record to the test Friday night as they welcome Cheney to town. The Cowboys a little short-handed though. Quarterback Delshawn Petrosky is out with an injury. Instead, it is Division I recruit Jason Hewlett running the show for the Cowboys. Cheney led it 13-7 at the break. Second half, Cardinals come out swinging. Brock Lowry keeps it himself, sheds a tackle, and has nothing but green grass ahead of him. Jason Hewlett would try and come from behind and bring him down, but Lowry would not be denied. 63 yards for the score. Canfield takes the lead after a Cowboys turnover. Canfield looking to turn it into points. Chris Samarone on the far side weaves his way in for the score from 15 yards out. Canfield up 28-13. Samarone Fired up. Then Cheney, though, hanging tough. It's Hewlett here, keeping himself, puts his head down at the goal line and gets in for the score. Cheney down just nine, but the Cardinals wouldn't let it get any closer. Handoff here to Sam Marone, makes a guy miss, and then check out the wheels from the big man. Down the sideline for the touchdown, 47 yards out. Canfield gets the win, now 5-0, and as playoff seating gets set to be voted on this week. Seeds are going to come up. We've done what we can do. Uh, they're going to place us in the bracket. We're going to go play anybody we're told to play. We always go say go 1 and 0 every week and uh, be 5 and 0. We can, I think we get a high seed now. We have a good opportunity in the playoffs to get a bunch of home games. Yeah. I mean, if we're not the number one seed, well, or if we're the two or three seed, we can have four home games yeah. during the playoffs. That's big for us. In Canfield with the Cardinals, I'm Josh Verkedek.